Hey there, football fans. Welcome back to Football News Center, your one-stop shop for all the latest updates in the world of football. Today, we've got some controversial news coming out of Nottingham Forest. It seems that Nottingham Forest has been left frustrated after being informed that the video assistant referee, or VAR, did not have the power to rule out Brentford's disputed equalizer in their recent match. Let me break it down for you. During the match, Brentford's Ivan Tony moved the ball for a free kick, wiping away the referee's vanishing foam as he lined up the wall. Now, Forrest believed that this action should have been spotted by the referee, Darren England, and the goal should have been disallowed. However, the referee's body, Professional Game Match Officials Limited, clarified that according to the VAR protocol set by the International Football Association Board, VAR has no authority to intervene on restarts. So, unfortunately for Forrest, the goal stood, and Brentford went on to win the match 3-2. Understandably, Forrest expressed their frustration by writing to refereeing chief Howard Webb for clarification. Manager Nuno Espirito Santo also voiced his disappointment, stating that the reality of the game was changed by Tony's actions. He believes that this issue should be looked into, as it has a significant impact on the outcome of matches. Santo did. However, acknowledge that Forrest also had a responsibility in the situation. He mentioned that they should have said something and prevented the free kick from being taken in the first place. Unfortunately, neither the referee nor the linesman spotted the ball displacement, and now Forrest has to move forward from this setback. It's certainly a contentious issue, and it raises the question, should Brentford striker Tony's goal have stood? We'd love to hear your thoughts, so make sure to leave a comment down below. That's all for today's update on Nottingham Forest. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell, so you never miss any of our future videos. And remember, for all your football news, stay tuned to Football News Center. See you next time.